sitting here Friday morning, trying to get to Vegas, trying to get to this Pennywise show, Saturday, man laid bay at the House of Blues. In the car waiting, waiting for Christina to get her ass in the car so we can leave. Got the Dover. Dover in. Hey. Very stern. But hopefully, there he is. Hopefully in the next fucking five seconds here, we can get going. Get this trip on its way. Ideally. Anyhow. <laughs> everybody it, it sure is morning <laughs> it's definitely morning we went to bed late watching our vegas movies <laughs> got up early it's the day after thanksgiving uh we skipped thanksgiving this year because we are headed to vegas today actually right now we are right now just dropped off the pooch who's not pleased he's not but they love him there uh, so we are headed to the airport and we've got some exciting stuff going on for this trip. Short trip. Sh super short trip. This is the shortest trip I think we've ever taken. Yeah, Friday to Sunday. And today we actually get to meet Pennies for Vegas Mark yeah. for the first time. So we're super excited about that. And, and we get to meet JR Fouille Travelers. Yeah, we get to meet Josh and Rachel. Josh. And Rachel! <laughs> so we're excited to meet them. Uh, they like a lot of the same food we do. So uh, we're going to Oscars tonight. Um, we wanted to take pennies there. So we had a reservation for five because we were hoping the Kinos might show up. Which still... Still hope they will, but... But you, you never, never know, know when they show up. But when they do, we'll see them in Vegas. Uh, they swear they're not coming, but we made a reservation for five people. Mercy gets in while we're at dinner, so we're hoping she'll be able to make it over there before everything's over. Um, but yeah, we're when we get in, we're gonna check in at Mandalay Bay, head down to Fremont, meet Pennies, hang out with him for the afternoon, and go to dinner. Uh, Josh and Rachel are gonna meet us right before, and then Mercy should fly in. She should land like right before dinner starts. taking off so we're gonna say bye to Matthew <laughs> but we can't get over there because he's probably an international hope you had a great trip we're about to start ours first escalator to Vegas nailed it did you though did you nail it no no I didn't <laughs>
twenty dollar trick does work. Is it a trick though? I don't know. Is it? <laughs> Mandalay Bay. Mandalay Bay. And we got an upgrade. Upgrade. And we got a penthouse suite, and this is a baby. I'm so glad that I found you. Now I got someone to bring.
big a Caesar is? Explain, Felina. Yeah. Okay, so what's a Caesar? Caesar uh, is called clam juice. Fish juice. Fish juice. Fish juice. And what else? Uh, vodka. Vodka yeah. and Tabasco. Yeah. yeah. Mandarin juice. Orange juice. No. No? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's got that clam thing inside. Did you ever see the one that Matrix made? No. Yeah. Oh, oh it was like disgusting. I think I remember. It was we, we, a while met, ago, right? Did you? I know you met Bridger, right? No, I, I thought you met Bridger. I have not. The only British people I've met is uh, us. I mean, obviously. Yeah. I told you that. I thought you were here, so and I knew that this is where you were. Because Very nice. This is where we come. We love yeah. it. Can you take a picture of us? Yeah. Are now my enemies Always tell you what to do Can't keep up with all the bullshit they're throwing your way Flip and Tara. <laughs> Good to see you guys for a couple minutes. 
And now we are going to the Bellagio Conservatory with Mercy. We're gonna check out the Christmas display.
To review, yeah. So we have beer nuts from Liz, the mayor, buffet princess. How are they? Very good. Are they really good? Yes. I'm excited. So they came in a Christmassy bag, and they look amazing. I'm gonna try these. Oh my god. They are good. Better than the crap in the gift shop. Thanks, Liz. We love them. <laughs> All right, so we forgot to end day one because we had so much fun. <clears throat> yeah. So what happened? It would have made a good outro. It would have made an excellent outro. And in fact, we were on the Mandalay Bay, or not Mandalay Bay, Bellagio walkway last night and thought about outroing and then we didn't. We didn't do it. And that's our outro spot. So now you just get a boring silver outro for yesterday. <laughs> Sorry about that. We'll try harder today. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, so we got in at 1.30, no, 2 o'clock, because we were late, delayed for a light bulb. And we got here. Checked into Mandalay Bay. Yeah. Did the $20 trick. And we got 
a room upgrade to the penthouse suite, mm -hmm. which is amazing. It's one of the most beautiful rooms I've ever seen. Pretty nice room. Yeah, it's, it's amazing. So the deal was $50 extra a night, and then he took off our resort fees, which was about $88. So we paid $100, took off $88. And we got this amazing room. I think he said it's a thousand square feet. Yeah. Um, it's got a living room, a kitchen, or kitchenette, fridge, two bathrooms. And the bathroom in here is ginormous. Two closets, which the kinos were not in. No. We did a lot of detective work you yesterday. Know, you know where we didn't search, though? Where? Mercy's hair. We did not check Mercy's hair. We should have. We'll have to check that later. Because maybe they've been in here the whole time. Okay, so we got showered and changed, headed down to Fremont Street, and met Penny's at the Golden Nugget, which was awesome. Yeah. So Penny's, tall. <laughs> he's a tall individual. He's a tall. So we hung out with Penny's. We went over to Main Street Station and yeah. met up with Paulina and Dave. The who, Sutcliffs? The Sutcliffs. Team Sutcliffe, who are awesome. Yeah. They're from the UK, so had a great time with them, had some drinks, got a little buzzed. No. For sure. Um, then we went over to Oscars at Plaza for dinner. Yeah. And we met Josh and Rachel of JR Food and Travels. No. <laughs> um, <laughs> Kino just texted us. He asked if... Uh, Anthony has cheated death. We'll get to that in just a minute. Um, so we had dinner with Josh and Rachel at Oscars. And Penny's. And Penny's. We had filet mignon, and I had mac and cheese. Anthony had asparagus, asparagus, plural, asparagus. Uh, Josh and Rachel had a rib cap and New York strip, a cream corn, and Penny's had the prime rib. Which the prime rib actually looked like the best thing that anybody got at the table. Yeah. So I think he lucked out there with, <laughs> with the best ordering skills. Um, so that looked really good. Um, and then we went over to Bar Canada, met up with the Sutcliffs again. And we tried Caesars for the first time. They're not terrible. I liked it, but I thought it was a little on the sweet side, which I wasn't expecting. I was hoping for more like salty and spicy, but it was good. Not bad. Yeah, and it was lighter than a Bloody Mary, which I didn't realize. So Penny's explained us that Clamato is a lot thinner than tomato juice. So you're not like having like a thick milkshake of a cocktail. Um, so it goes down a little easier. And Anthony wore his Caesar shirt that Liz made him, mm -hmm. which was really cool. Then we said goodnight to Penny's because he had an early flight. Um, good night to the Sutcliffs. We came back and played at Mandalay Bay with Mercy. Um, Anthony played Hot Dollar. Yes. <laughs> Tell us about Hot Dollar. Hot Dollar. Hot Dollar. <laughs> is hot Dollar. We came to the conclusion Top Dollar's Walmart cousin. <laughs> And the bonuses reflect that. Yes. How much did you win? I, I lost. That first bonus. Oh, what? I don't even remember. $8.75. Oh, yeah. Lots of hoopla for $8.75. Which would be a boom shock a lock at a pennies. Yeah. <laughs> so, we played that. Um, I guess you guys lost. I played the leprechaun thing that I played with cinnamon. And I won. I put 40 bucks in one up to or got it up to 175 played it down to like 150 and then we were trying to find other machines and it feels like the like slot machine selection here isn't that great like a lot of the machines that we love are just not here there's a lot of dragon link a lot of ultimate fire link there's luxury line but there's like not 007 willy wonka there's four Planet Moolahs, but they're always taken. Yeah, there's three because one was broken. Oh yeah, one was broken. All the slot couch machines are broken. Um, I found a pinball, but it sucked. Um, yeah, tell us about that. <laughs> about so <laughs> we found that because we tried Crystal's trick of using the high limit bathroom, which was gross. 
Um, it was really tiny and dirty in there. Um, we looked at the machines in there and I found a pinball machine and I thought it was $5 a spin. I was like, oh, I can handle $5 a spin. Um, at least on pinball because it usually pays out at area. Um, so I took my winning Tito and put it in there and proceeded to lose it all in 30 seconds. So it was not a good pinball. It was not $5 a spin. It, it was, was $15 a spin. Yeah. All right, thank you. Because you have to do max bet to get all the pinballs. And um, not worth it. It was pretty terrible. <laughs> but at the end of the day, I only ever put $40 in yesterday. And I left with $3. So, you know, I got up to $175. But it was money I won anyway. So, um, yeah. So, then we ended the night. Came back up to the room. Got some sleep. That's it. Yeah. That was day one. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you at sunrise. Yeah, yeah, yeah.